Nearly 170,000 people in Florida have filed for unemployment last week. And among them, thousands of people drove up to the 30 sites at public libraries in Miami-Dade to pick up unemployment applications. CBS 4's Peter Dench is in Hialeah, where he spoke to some people who braved the long lines to get their chance to sign up. These sites have been handy for people needing to drive up and pick up applications for unemployment assistance. This one site of the John F. Kennedy Library in Hialeah has been busy ever since it opened in the morning. It's tough. It is tough. As of now, I'm living day by day. Helades Rodriguez plans to mail off this application for unemployment benefits to the state as soon as she can. So I hope to get some, some money at least to keep afloat until this ends. Rodriguez joined hundreds of people in line here. I have savings, you know, but there's so much money you can you can use. It is one of four sites in Hialeah helping those like Victor Rodriguez who were unable to get help online. Hopefully we'll get better, and I think it will get better, but mid, at the meantime, we need money and medicine. We realized that more than ever, the first day we got out here, what the demand was. A lot of people out of work, a lot of people expecting to lose their jobs. 8,000 people flooded Hialeah sites on the first day. 4,000 residents applied for benefits on Wednesday. I hope that the state's going to really move, and once they get these applications, they can break the, you know, give those checks out immediately because every week it's going to get worse and worse. Like I said, people can't buy food now. So not only are they worried about the virus, but also about feeding their families. Two pages need to be filled out on the application. Your signature is needed on the third page. There's an address where it should be sent to the State Department of Economic Opportunity. I would put a stamp on it and I would mail it myself directly. Miami Dade is open 26 other sites at public libraries all around Miami Dade. Commissioner Joe Martinez is proposing a super site be set up here at Tamiami Park. Here at Tamiami Park, and you'll be able to see soon, we'll be able to stack thousands of cars on site and be able to give them this application. What I'm proposing on using used to be the Grand Prix uh, racetrack. We used to have a racetrack here and do it. So three cars can fit side by side very easily here. Martinez will now be sending his proposal to Miami-Dade Mayor Carlos Jimenez. He says Tamiami Park could handle up to 3,000 vehicles and could become one of the most productive sites in the county. In Hialeah, Peter Danch, CBS 4 News. For a complete listing of the 30 sites where you can pick up that application for unemployment benefits in Miami-Dade, just go to our website, cbsmiami.com slash coronavirus.